Hi friends, let's see our next hacker rank problem, find the median. So the difficulty level of this problem is easy and the max score allocated for this problem is 35 points. Now let's see the problem statement. So the problem statement is the median of a list of numbers is essentially its middle element after sorting. The number of elements occur after it as before and given a list of numbers with an odd number of elements and we are supposed to find the median. Okay. So from the given statement we are supposed to notice few important points and based upon those points we are supposed to go ahead with the problem. So here out of the two important points the first point is the median that means they have given an array of elements okay so in the array of elements obviously the median is nothing but the middle element okay after sorting so this is the one important point and the second important parameter need to be considered is the array okay that means the length of the array is always an odd number okay so this is what two important hints we are you can observe from the problem statement now let's see the example so here the example they have given like uh, they have given an array with some the numbers are aligned in some random order not the sorting order okay so this is the array of length 5 okay with consisting of elements 5 3 1 2 and 4 okay so now before finding the median the first important parameter is as it is mentioned here the median is always the middle element after sorting so before finding the median we are supposed to sort the given array so the sorted array becomes 1 2 3 4 5 okay so this is a sorted array so obviously just by seeing the array we can find that the middle element is going to be the element 3 okay so it is of length 5 so obviously the middle element is the 3 okay so this is going to be the median now they have given the function description so so integer array of n which is unsorted we are supposed to find the unsorted array of integers so let's see another example here it is given an example so this is how the sample input is going to be so the first line consisting the array of that means the length of an array and the second line consisting of the array okay so here if you observe the array consisting of elements which are in some random order okay not the sorted order that means either ascending or descending it is in some random order so once you sort this particular array so it is going to become like this some 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay so this is the sorted array so if you observe as mentioned in the problem statement the length of the that means the length of the array is going to be an odd number so if you observe here the index value starts from 0 okay so the index values ends will be up to 6 so this is the array which is of length 7 so obviously here just by observing the array we can say that the element 3 is going to be the middle element which is the median for the given array so this is how we can suppose to find out the median okay so now before proceeding to the problem that means before solving the problem let me explain it even more clear and with the procedure that how what we will be following to find the median okay so here i have taken a sample array so here i have taken this array input array so this array of length 7 so it is in the non sorted order okay so here let after sorting the array becomes like this so it is going to be in the sorting order so here i have sorted in the ascending manner okay that means starting from low value to the high value okay so now this will be the newly sorted array okay so this is the newly sorted array so now here for this particular array okay the index value we know that always the index value for an array the always the index value starts from zero okay so for this particular array the array of zeroth element is going to be one and the array of one value is three and the array of two is four and the array of three that means the third index value is five and the fourth index value is seven and the fifth index value is eight and the sixth index value is nine okay 
now let's see so we know that uh, so this is a simple mathematics we are nowhere dealing with the array here okay so the length of the array is going to be 7 and when you suppose divide the length by 2 in that case this is a simple max there is no logic magic over here okay so 7 by 2 is going to be 3.5 okay and here just to give an example that that means just to uh, make you aware of what is the floor and what is the seal value i am taking this particular example and all these things so here for the 3.5 the floor value of 3.5 is going to be 3 and the seal value of 4 point this particular 3.5 is going to be 4 okay so now i'm just repeating one more thing so the length of the array is going to be 7 and the length by 2 is going to be 3.5 and for this 3.5 the floor value is going to be 3 and the seal value is going to be 4 okay now as we know so suppose here we need to find out the middle element so the middle element if you find the middle element of the given array after sorting and that middle element is going to be our median value and that is what we required so here if you observe suppose if i take in the floor value okay floor value is going to be 3 and we know that why I'm taking the floor value. Let me explain here. So the total length of the array is going to be 7. Okay. Suppose and we know the one more important point. We know that in an array the index value always starts from 0 not 1. Okay. So this is the main important point. In an array the index value always starts from 0. So in that case. So I know that. So just by seeing this particular array. I can say that. The median value is going that means the middle value of this array is going to be 5 so what is the index of 5 the index of 5 is going to be 3 okay so that suppose if i take the floor value then only i can i can able to find out the exact middle value if i take the seal value it is going to give the wrong results so that is why i have taken the floor value so i hope this clears the way of doing problem and that means we can we can solve the problems in very two basic simple steps first of all we are going to find out the floor value and the array of that particular floor value is going to be our middle or the median value that's all let's go with the problem yeah let me take the side by side view so here as usual uh, let's select the programming language as javascript here it is now first of all as usual let us console log the given parameter or the array and let me run the code i know it is going to give the wrong answer because i have not done the solution yet i just simply consoling the given parameters that means arguments so this is going to be the given array yeah fine now let me go back to the problem so here what we need to do first of all we need to sort the given array okay so array dot sort i am just using the dot predefined javascript default sorting method so a comma b so here i am sorting with respect to the ascending order so even though you sort with respect to the descending order also the answer is going to be same it is not going to change for ascending or for descending it is whatever it is you can choose that is up to you so the answer is going to be the same for whichever the sorting it is so i have sorted this particular array now let me find the middle element okay let middle is equals to let me take a simple variable middle okay so what i'm going to do i'm going to use the javascript predefined method floor method math dot floor of array dot length by two okay so for this particular input so which is of length seven the middle value is going to be that means the math dot floor so seven by two is going to be three point five and the math dot floor of 3.5 is 3 which i was explained just before so now simply let me return the array of middle value and this array of middle value is going to be our median for the given array now let me run the code yeah it passes the basic test case now let me submit the code yeah passed all the test cases yeah and we have earned 35 points let's see our next hacker problem in the next session thank you